Hey guys, what's going on? How's everyone doing today? I'm doing well, thank you for asking. The body beat down here, Michael, is at your service. Today is arm day. Today we're gonna to keep it simple. I'm gonna do one movement for my biceps and I'm gonna do one movement for my triceps. And that's gonna be it today. Sticking to one movement, one basic movement, keeps things simple and to the point. What are we wanting to do on arm day? We're wanting to grow a bigger bicep, right? and we're wanting to grow a bigger tricep. So really, the best movements you can do for that are just a simple exercise. We don't have to go crazy. We don't have to make it complicated. Why'd you have to go and make things so complicated? Yeah. Anyway, so today I'm gonna to be doing some straight bar curls. Uh, this is about a five or six foot tall uh, Olympic bar. It's a thicker bar than all of my other Olympic bars. I don't know uh, the diameter of it exactly. And it's definitely thicker than the uh, easy bar. So I chose that today for that reason and to hit my arms just a little differently because I typically will use the easy bar. So today we're going to work with the uh, smaller but extremely heavy and compact uh, straight bar. I got a 10 on each side which which makes it I think 54 pounds yeah uh, the bar the bar alone weighs 34 pounds so we're gonna get in a little exercise here and I hope you join in guys let's build some big arms let's build some big old arms guys We're gonna take it nice and slow. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good job, good job. Now I'm going to do a few sets where I can get some really good movement range of motion like you just seen. And I'll probably do a couple of sets where I go a little heavier and uh, really put the stress and strain on the muscle. And uh, we'll go from there. Uh, so stick around guys and uh, hope you enjoy. Work out alongside of me. And uh, let's get big arms. Rawr. All right, boys and girls, we got 74 pounds now. I just put another 10 on each side. Uh, let's get a good, good workout, guys. One, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Want to try to make sure you get your good little squeeze. All right, when you come up, that's a, that's how we get those fibers to open up. All right, get that blood going. All right, got to pump that in there. All right, we'll do another set. Stick around. I think we got 84 pounds going on now. I took off all the 10s and I put a 25 on each side where, so with the bar we're at 84 pounds. 25 on each side. <clears throat> Let's get these done. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Woo! But pretty good, guys. 
felt pretty good. I don't know how high we're gonna be going with these. I wanna push myself a little bit, but uh, we'll see. Stick around, keep doing your thing. Leave comments, leave questions, say hi, all that good stuff. Like, share, subscribe, comment to the bite. Be down with me. Let's move on to the next set, guys. All right, so I put a 10 on each side and now we're up to 104 pounds. This is where you want to get careful. Uh, be, be careful because bending over to get a bar can uh, really aggravate your back and throw it out. I have had it happen. Of course, I have a bad back anyway, but it can happen really easily when doing curls. So try to, try to keep in mind what you're doing. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Steps. 
I uh, had a good workout. My arms are feeling, my biceps are feeling pretty good. I'm glad I went ahead and decided to go up kind of heavy on those. And uh, then I did work my way back down and got in some, uh, again, some cleaner reps and uh, more reps. So now we're on to tricep. And today I'm probably gonna stick with one movement for the tricep. And I'm gonna use the V bar and do press downs. I haven't used this in forever. I really don't use it very often. I don't find it all that comfortable, like I thought I would like it and all, but today I'm gonna use it. And I'm starting off with only 50 pounds on the machine. So let's go ahead and get a set of these done and uh, uh, go along with me, do whatever it is you're doing. We're doing this as a team, as a community. It don't matter if you're doing push-ups and sit-ups, join in. All right, let's do this, guys. I'll leave it running, I think I'm in a good spot here. Good enough. So, let's get a good set in, guys. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. All right, I went ahead and decided to do 12 instead of 10 for whatever reason. Um, now I could use the rope, as you've seen me use a dozen times. Where's it at? About right in there. There's the rope hanging there. Now the rope does allow for a little bit more uh, maneuverability. These bars like this keep you kind of locked in and uh, they can dig into your arms or to your hands even a little bit. But since I use the rope quite often and I've used the straight bar quite often, and and the handles that I got, I use those pretty often anymore. I thought I'd go ahead and use the V-bar. So I'm gonna do one more set of the 50 and then we'll add a little weight, okay? So let's get that done. Now don't be looking at that video if you can see it. Pretty old girl dancing around. Horrible. All right, let's do it. One, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Now you'll notice on the first set I was leaning a little bit more forward. On this set I was a little bit more straight. You can do whatever you want. Each uh, each kind of position that you get in kind of changes how it feels just a little bit on the tricep. How you hold the bar, how you position your elbows and and how you let your body move just in general can affect every muscle that you're working out. So just play around with whatever you want and mix and match it during the same exercise. It don't matter, have fun. All right, I'm gonna add some more weight, guys. We'll be back in a minute on The Body Be Down. Like, share, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff. All right, guys, I went ahead and threw a 10 on each side, so we're up to 70 pounds. So far, nothing super crazy. So. Let's get another set. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah. All right, guys. You stick around and don't go anywhere. We're going to do more. Lots more. another 10 on each side so we're going up to 90 pounds side so we are up to an even 100 pounds and this is going to be my last set of these and then I'm going to jump over to rope press downs. Michael I thought you were going to just do one exercise per body part. Well I am kind of. Press downs are close to the same thing 
And I'm not feeling this as well as I do the ropes. So I don't want to waste any more time doing five more sets of this whenever I can throw the rope on here and uh, get a little bit more engagement into the triceps. This is doing pretty good, but it's okay. It's a, you gotta try them for yourself. So let's get a set of 100. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, to the rope I took uh, some of the weight off we just got a 25 on each side now which is 50 pounds I did some math and I figured that out so uh, we're gonna do five sets of some rope press downs one two three four five six seven Eight, nine, ten. Ooh. Stick around, keep kicking butt, guys. It's what we're doing today, we're kicking butt. We'll see you in a minute. All right, I'm pretty much sticking with the 50 pounds on the machine. This is gonna be my third set. I wanna show you a little variation on your stance, on how you can stand. And uh, there's, again, there's many variables. There's different ways of standing and adjusting your arms and elbows and just everything. So let me show you one. We'll take a look at that right now. Let me adjust the camera. How's everybody doing today? I'm doing well, yada, yada, yada. All right, maybe that'll be good. We'll see. All right, pay attention, guys. We're gonna stand I'm standing about a foot from my feet uh, from the machine. Now that's my machine, of course. Your machines will differ. And we're gonna bend at the waist, bend the knees a little, and we're gonna kick them arms back. One, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten. Ooh, start from camera movement. Now again, anytime you can add a little bit of a variation to the movement, it's good. It's gonna hit that muscle just a little bit differently. Well guys, I'm gonna do two more sets of some uh, rope press downs. And I'm gonna be done. I hope you enjoy the arm workout. And again, you don't have to work out the same body part as I do while you're watching. You can do whatever you wanna do, man. You can jog in place, you can do housework, sit-ups, jumping jacks, jump rope. You can be flipping tires and carrying yokes and doing whatever it is you wanna do, guys. The, 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 the reason for all this is to have someone to do something with and to help motivate and drive you. I happen to be lucky and blessed in that department. I've never had to be really pushed and motivated by other people, but some people do. Some people have to have that push and uh, that accountability that you know they're there with somebody doing something, whether it's at a gym or uh, someone's home gym or their own gym and people come over or what have you. Uh, there, there's a, a lot of factors to it. So uh, anyway, I've been uh, lucky that I just, I kind of push myself and I've, I've always done that. So I'm here for you, but I hope you're here for me too, guys. Because sometimes we all do need that little extra. All right, so I'm gonna get these done and uh, go cook my supper. If I remember, since I'm doing this video, I'm gonna edit the video after I eat. So I'll try to remember to put in a uh, picture of my food that I'm making. We're making I'm making some uh, iron skillet steaks. Uh, I'm making myself a big old sweet potato. And uh, I'm gonna have some green beans. And my wife's gonna have a steak, a regular potato, and some green beans. So anyway, guys, like, share, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff to the Body Beatdown. 
Hope you enjoyed. I hope my little bit of dancing around and acting goofy kind of puts a little smile on your face. It does me when I do it. I like to act stupid. So get up, get out, get ready to do it to it. We'll see you next time on the Body Beatdown. See ya. Get up, get out, get ready to do it to it.